What's up, guys? Today, we're going to show you my huge book collection. I mean, huge. So, let's get right into it. First, we're going to start off with the Captain Underpants series. So, let's get these books down here. So, here we got some of them. will be in Spanish. Because most of them are actually. So, I might not be able to read it. I'm an Irish fan, but let's just get right into it. So, the first one is in English. It is Captain Underpants and an Attack of the Talking Toilets. This was a good one because it had good flip around ones. And it was very funny, man. It was Captain Underpants books. Next, we have Captain Underpants and the, ba and the Battle of the Bad Booger Boy. Part one night of the nasty nostril nuggets. Another great and funny one. Don't know what is that sticker? Disney Pixar. Hmm. But it was a really good book. We did get the sticker for good books. We were good to one of the last books. Anyway, good book. And then this one I'm guessing is like I don't know if you guys can read that. Come down below for you guys. But all the all the other ones. Orange Bruce, it's out of the adventures of Captain Underpants, the first book. And so, yeah. This video. No, not really. Next. And next we have the Diver and Piquet series. Here we have Diver and Piquet Old School. A great Diver and Piquet. I love this book. Next we have the Do It Yourself books. Two of them actually. I'm getting one of these. Give me this one. Here. Yep. We have two. Now we have these two, which a friend gave me. Dive Room Beacon Cabin Fever and Dive Room Beacon Hard Luck. These are two ones, really good ones. And then this one I got from Angel Captain's birthday. It's Dog Days. Dropping his ice cream cone, like me. And then we've got the Nickelodeon Six Time Kid Choice winner. Now we're going to go Jeff Kidney, the New York One Time Bestseller. Dive Room Beacon. You even got the Nickelodeon because it's just called Nickelodeon Kid Choice World. Let's go into wrap it up for that real big kid. You see, you can look at all of that as I'm moving them. Just moving them. These are going to have the same back. Uh, the do it yourself books. But anyway. So I'm going to put this back. So there you have it. The Diving Pictures. Next we have. These books. Now. These are just like. Random books. So we're just going to start off with our these books. Um. Yeah. So here we go. Oh, and I forgot to put the back there. 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 we go. Next, we have Goosebumps Orlin, who is your mommy. That's cool. And I have a little dummy three. And Summer Slappy. That was, really, that was pretty fast, actually. Two more of those. Two more books. Right here. Two more books. Goose Pump Slap the World. Please do not feed the weirdo. And Goose Pumps present Slappy's Tales of Horror. Two really fun books. Now we have. I have to pull this out. This is. 
in the tower, but oh god, oh gosh, yeah, yeah. Um, first we have um, Stink, Thinkable Shrinking, Shrinking Kid. Got some more Stink books right here. Stink and the Midnight Zombie Walk. Stink, Solar System Superhero. Stink and the worm, World's Worst Super Stinky Sneakers. Stink, oh, we already got that today. Here we have the last kid on Earth, a really good zombie book. That one a zombie book. Giving away. The last kid on Earth, the zombie parade. I'll be giving away that book on the channel pretty soon. Here we have Escape from Horrorland, Goosebumps. One of my favorite series, Puppy Pirates. X marks the spot. Here we have, is that a dead dog in your locker? Yeah, good book. And we have the Third Grade Angels. Fun book for third graders. Is that Stretch Volcano Blast? Um... Two cartoon book double trouble sugar and spice why aren't they nice? Um the Sponge Out of Water movie book the junior novelation is telling me what the there's a Pokemon card in here. Two Pokemon cards book in there. I mentioned any Pokemon card can I'll give this away if it doesn't want it. But it tells about all of the it's just about all of the cool characters in Sponge Out of Water. Goosebumps, Night of the Living Dummy. Last book, Mighty Robot. Ricky Ricotta's Mighty Robot. There's a Pulp Joe sticker. So that was a fun book. Just have to set these out back this way. And put like this. No, why are they all fun? Stay. No, they're all fun. Stop. We're putting. So now we're just putting the last few of this ginormous stack. Yeah, I'm telling you, I have a huge bookcase. Look, look at this. I'm gonna show you. Look at this bookcase. In here. Look at this bookcase. It's three layers and then there and then up there. We're not gonna show since there's a coloring books, but I'm gonna show these ones right here. Moving on to these ones. This, you know what? We're not even gonna do these ones. We'll do some of these stuff. So here we have Who Would Win? Lobster versus Crab. Who do you guys think would win? Comment down below. And then here we have Little City Apara and Encidio, which stopped the fire. Lego book. To another, oh, a sequel. I give one, I'll give us goosebumps away. Another sloppy. We have Attack of the Ender. I got someone dropped this. Nightmare on Clown Street. I'll give us the Ender goosebumps away. We have a Finding Nora giant book. Big toy book. What the fuck were you supposed to have toys in it? Oh, didn't have toys in it. So, now we have this book, a giant, enormous book. I bet it takes forever to read this. Oh, brothers, but it is called The Land of Stories, the Christian Royal Spell. Look at that. So, guys. 
Well, that, I think that'll be wrap this um, video up. Got some more notification over there like this. Well, don't let you guys see you.